My name is Mairead and I'm an approved mental health professional. Section 117 Aftercare is a legal duty that is placed on the health and social services in order to provide aftercare services for individuals who have been detained under Section 3, Section uh, 37, Section 47 and 48 and 45A. This is a duty that um, comes into effect once the person has been discharged from hospital. The aim of Section 117 Aftercare is um, to provide services to enable people to prevent a further admission to a um, hospital. The Section 117 Aftercare is um, arranged by normally the care coordinator, however um, it is a multidisciplinary and multi-agency um, uh, responsibility. The um, legal responsibility is on the health and social services, however we do also work in a partnership with voluntary organisations in order to provide immediate services that a person needs in order to enable them to um, avoid another hospital admission. Section 117 lasts until the individual continues to need those services. Um, it, it is reviewed um, by multidisciplinary, usually under this care programme approach. Um, when it is decided by a health and social service representative in partnership with the service user, family um, or carers, that the person is no longer in need of such services, then Section 117 will be discharged. Um, I had a lady on my caseload who had a diagnosis of schizophrenia. Um, she, when well, was able to function, um, a highly functioning lady. Um, she was a mother of two children. However, following a, a detention under Section 3 of the Mental Health Act, um, upon discharge, her aftercare needs were that she required support in um, monitoring her to take her medication because at times she did forget to do this and also to support her in getting up in the morning to take her two children to school. Therefore, part of the aftercare plan was that she would have a support worker who would come into her house each morning, support her with getting the children up to, for school to enable her to take on her parenting role. Um, and also they would monitor her and prompt her to take a medication each day.